everyone, it's Joe Tamargo and this is my boy Robert over here. Today we're going to be talking about bearing seals and some good old fashioned lube for the seals, mechanical seal lube. So we just want to let you know, you've probably seen this in other videos like how to remove the seal, how to unbox the super pump, free, what videos when we're out in the freezing cold. So today we're basically going to show you that we have a ton of sock for you. Not only do we have the videos to uh, show you how to replace the parts, but we actually have the parts. Like, you know how you go to those other big sites, maybe like, they're even considered content farms at this place, and you see some like, person in there, and they're like, oh yeah, just change your seal like this, this, and this. You know, like, and you're like, dude, where do I even get the parts? You know, the guy doesn't mention the model number, and you're like, where do I buy it? And you, then you buy the wrong thing and pay the shipping just to only get the wrong part. So what we'll let you know is everything in our videos that we show you how to change out, we actually stock uh, ourselves. We're a distributor, and um, we can get you everything. We have uh, seals for all the pumps, for if it's a Hayward pump, uh, a Stay Right pump, any kind of pump. We could uh, your pool pump. We can get you a seal. Even other kind of pumps, we can get you seals for those. But today we're going to be talking about the bearings and seals for pool pumps. Okay, so we're going to want to go through what we have here. We also have capacitors as well. If you need to have a run start capacitor inside your electric motor for your pool pump, we also stock those. So what we're going to go over is uh, I'm going to show you that we have all kinds of bearings, 6203s, 6202s, 6204s, 6203LL10mm. We have all those brand new. Um, you'll find links below the video or to the side of the video of where to get them from in our store. These are the bearings that you can use to replace. Um, like, you know, other videos where I show you how to take the bearings off the shaft. Yep. Um, you'll see Robert in other videos taking these bearings off the shaft. You'll see me and Robert putting these bearings on. So if you have a pool pump motor <clears throat> that is a... Uh, if you have a pool pump motor that's making a lot of noise, it's making a grinding sound, you just need to change the bearings in those. These bearings, you could, you know, they're under $20 for two bearings. And uh, with an hour of your time and some make us hand tools, you could just change these bearings out and save yourself a lot of money because a, a brand new pool pump motor, replacement motor, runs anywhere between about $170 to $230 for the motor. Now, if you change the bearings in the motor, you buy the bearings for, you know, around $20 or so, a little bit under 20 bucks, plus a little bit shipping, right? That's 20, 30 bucks, a few hours of your time, you have a brand new pool pump motor. You saved $170 just by doing it yourself. And you can do it yourself because me and Robert here are going to show you. I mean, I was a pump mechanic and a pool mechanic for a lot of years. Um, Robert's just a pump mechanic helper. He's a trainee. He works in the shop with us rebuilding pool pumps. So if you don't want to do it yourself, you can use our other service. Well, we have a mail-in service. You can mail your pool pump to us. We'll rebuild it and mail it back to you. It's still actually cheaper than buying a new pump because a brand new Hayward Super Pump could cost you $400. You can mail it to us for $20. We'll rebuild it for you for $75. Mail it back for another $20. You know what I mean? That's a lot cheaper than uh, than buying a new pump. So over a little bit over a hundred dollars, then you have a whole brand new rebuilt pump. We spray paint the motor, change the bearings and seals for you, inspect all the parts. So that's the bearings. So if you need bearings, like I said, below the video to the side of the video, you can click the link up above uh, to the store, and you can just find those depending on what kind of pump we have. We have all the listings. Uh, so basically, if you have a Hayward Super Pump and you're not sure what bearing you need. You can just click to the Hayward Super Pump page. It will tell you what bearing you need, and it will show you the link to how to get there. So you just get the right bearing the right time. Like we said, we'll, we'll send it right out to you. We'll box it right out to you. We have bearings. Uh, the next thing is seals. We have a bunch of mechanical seals here. Depending on what size pump you have or what brand pump you have, we have all different seals to fit your needs. Inside the seals, these are great quality seals made by U.S. Seal. We also want to give that shout out to U.S. Seal if they ever watch this video. Great seals, one of the best in the business. I have actually, uh, I'm 37, and I've been working on pumps, pool pumps, since I was like 16 years old. So you could do the math and see how many years that is, and I've been using this actual brand of seals for that long. My first pool pump uh, that I rebuilt, I actually used a U.S. seal. So I've been using these seals for about 20 years now, and now I actually sell them to people like you to help you rebuild your pump. Inside the box, you can see all the uh, replacement parts that the seal comes with. So you got all the seals. <clears throat> Depending on what model you have, well, there'll be different parts in the box. This is a, a PS2131. This is a PS200. You can notice there's a couple little differences between the seals. But like I said, depending on what pump you need. Also, just go to the, your pump page. Just find your pump in the listings here in our pump replacement part guide. And you can just find, click on the kind of pump you have. It will tell you what kind of seal you need for your pump. Just like that. See, this one comes with a different couple other pieces. 
And uh, okay, we also, um, if you change a lot of seals, if you're a pump repair shop and uh, you're looking to buy a large quantity, we can also sell them to you wholesale if you like. Uh, we also sell several sizes of uh, mechanical seal loop. So when you put the seals on the shaft, uh, I'll give you a little demonstration here. Basically, let's say this is, you have a Hayward Super Pump. Here is your seal uh, housing. Here's your impeller. If you want to put a new seal on here, okay, see that? That's, see how it's squeaking? Listen. So what could happen is that rubber, say so it gets stiff, and what could happen is you could wind up breaking it or, you know, taking the seal off the shaft. So what you want to do is just take a little bit of uh, seal lubricant. You can put a little bit on your finger if you want there. You just put it on the inside of the bearing, I mean, uh, the inside of the seal. There, you can put a little bit on the uh, impeller shaft. Just like that. And see that? It, it just goes right on. And that's it. So we had those. If you're a pump shop or someone that does a lot of work, you know, maybe you're someone in the local neighborhood and you're... Here's another idea for you. If you're watching the video and you're actually a homeowner, <clears throat> and you're like, hey, I'm going to rebuild my pump, do yourself a favor. Put an ad on Craigslist and say, hey, I'm looking for used pool pumps that you don't want no more for 20 bucks each, right? Take them to your house, watch my videos, buy some bearings and seals, and rebuild them, and then flip them. You know what I mean? Like, you could buy a, a used pump off of somebody for 20 bucks that they're ready to throw out, buy some bearings and seals, uh, and actually a whole rebuild kit from us for under 50 bucks, rebuild it yourself in a couple hours, now you just paid $70 for a pool pump, right? And then you could put it back on Craigslist, like 200 which is half price of a new one, as a rebuild pump. And just make yourself 170 bucks. So you, I mean, if you're someone that does a lot of seal work, you can buy the larger size. This is the four ounce. This is the eight ounce here. If you do a lot of work, we also have uh, little tubes. If you're like the medium size guy. Um, now, if you're only buying one seal from us, we have some good news for us. We are giving you this uh, little tube free. Here's a little. Uh, it's just like a one-time use, one-shot thing. You just take a pair of scissors. You just cut this like this. Bam. Just like I showed you, put a little on your finger, wipe it inside the seal. So everyone that buys a seal, you get a little thing of lube free. So there's no reason to like, you know, like you're not a lot of places, you're like, oh, buy this accessory. And you're like, oh, let me add the seal lube on for four bucks. You're like, oh, four bucks, man. I just wanted to buy the seal. Don't worry about it. We'll give this little thing for free, a little pillow of a uh, lubricant. You'll be good. But if, like I said, if you're someone that does a lot of work, you're going to be real big looking for the neighbors or something like that, then that's that. Next thing we also have is start capacitors. Like I said, in the back of your mo uh, motors, depending on what kind of motor you have, you'll have a star capacitor like Hayward suit pumps. A lot of them use star capacitors. These capacitors go if you're getting a humming sound from your pump. And just like that, and your pump don't start up. Well, the chances are, if your bearings aren't seized, uh, you can use a capacitor. We have every capacitor for every pump. No matter what you need, we got that capacitor as well. So once again, me and Robert just wanted to show you that we have bearings, seals, seal lubrication, capacitors, we're ready to go. Uh, if you're looking to buy one seal or many seals, get in contact with us. Use the order form. Look at the links below. Hit the store button up above, and we'll be happy to help you. If you have any questions about the seals before you purchase, please feel free to use the contact form. Um, if we don't get back to you in three hours, listen, I'm an anxious guy myself, but we do get a lot of emails. We're also shooting videos here. We're not at the computer. So we'll get back to you within 24 to 40 hours, no problem if you can wait that long. And we'll definitely have any questions. If you want to say, hey, what kind of seal? Or if you, have a, if you need a salt application, you know, you have a pull, uh, like a salt water application and you need that kind of seal instead of just standard, we can also get you those kind of seals. So let us know if you have any questions. Thank you for watching. And uh, let us know what you need. We'll see you next video. Take it easy.